I'm aboard the Wensleydale Flyer. It is a bus service that provides a vital link for many people into the beautiful Yorkshire Dales, but its future was very much under threat due to a lack of funding. That finance for the flyer has now been found, and it'll keep it running for another year, thanks to a locally organised crowdfunding campaign and a sponsorship deal from a local business. It means everything, because otherwise I wouldn't get anywhere. I'd stay in at home, and it's no good. Uh, when you go and see people, go and see your friends who want to get to Richmond and places, and, and you can't get there, and you rely on the buses, I guess. The service is managed by a subsidiary of the charity, the Yorkshire Dales Society. But now there are fears that the wider Dales bus service network and routes in many other of the UK's national parks may disappear due to cuts in government support for local authority transport budgets. We've got the best integrated network of leisure bus services any national park in England, possibly in Europe. But sadly, we're not getting support from government, we're not getting support even from the National Park Authority that's got no cash. And unless we find other ways of keeping it going, sadly, we're going to have to cut back services and maybe to a point where we're going to lose some of these wonderful services. As well as being a lifeline for many older people in rural communities, buses bring tourists, especially walkers, into the areas. I crossed the hill just a short distance from the route of the flyer to the home of the man credited with bringing the Tour de France to Yorkshire. Speaking from his kitchen of his remote Coverdale cottage, Sir Gary Verity emphasised the need for reliable transport networks in areas like the Dales. Rural economies, and particularly upland rural economies like the Yorkshire Dales, are pretty fragile economically. The whole thing is held together and it wouldn't take much for something to start to unravel it. So pubs are really important. Um, local businesses and shops are really important. Uh, local provenance in terms of food and drink. And clearly transport is really important. The Wensdale Flyer is the kind of thread that pulls the whole thing together and enables people who haven't got access to a motor car or choose not to have access to a motor car to move around the Dales. So more campaigns to save services in our national parks are going to be needed to keep the buses running. Meanwhile, for the famous Wensleydale Flyer, well, its future is safe for the time being, at least.